up everyone this is Shasha SJ again today we are going to review a craft tools Ta-da! I know I have so much stuff going on and look at that let's review these craft tools and I kind of like these because it's you know new thing I guess I don't know, but we'll see. And let's compare the one that I have, my old ones. I have my Creative Memories. This one is my Creative Memories. If you want this item, check on the description down below. I love this, guys. I all love my stuff. And this one, I got this one. And. I gotta review this too. So here we go. Let's open this. I was like, I really want this one because I love the color. The one that I have is, um, it's not as old, but I, I love it. And the thing that I want this one is that if you work on some, if you want to hang this out in front of your table or something, you can hang it. There's a hole in it, but I don't want to hang it. But, but this is just like the option. You know, it's easy to reach. And one thing that I like is in comparison with my other trimmer. I have tons of trimmer, you guys. So... This is just my mini one when I make a card. I use this very, very, very much. So this one is, this, the one that I have is, is just plain. And the craft tool, the one that I have, the new one that we just opened, there's like a semi glass in it. Like a semi. I don't know if it's just a plastic looking, but it's, it's, um kind of glass something I don't know but the one thing that I like is when I'm holding this press thingy and this one is super tiny short and I'm so afraid if I have to put my finger here or here because it's very close to the um, blade as if you know what I mean I still like this one though, but as a comparison, this one is a little bit taller and bigger. And this one has a six inch. And from here, it's it's taller. See, it's taller. If, as you can see, it's taller. And one thing that I like as well is that this thing here is all the way down. Like it's almost down. Like even if... And one thing that I like on it, like for example, this one, this one has nothing to hold your finger. See it goes out like your finger like when you push it. It's scary because it will just go through but this one as you can see if I put my finger there's a stopper in there like your finger is protected by that stopper if you know what I mean like there's a finger stopper if you can see what I'm talking about so I like it because it protects my finger and though it's kind of like movie in there, maybe because you can use a thicker kind of paper or a whatever. But I'm going to use this only for my card making. And I really like it because it makes me feel safe on my finger when I cut. I know it's kind of like eh, screeching. Anyway, I'm sorry about that. But I have this paper. I have this kind of like felt-ish paper with a puppy paw prints. So cute. 
it's fuzzy it's like felt and I have this sparkle stuff paper and I have the regular paper and a thin kind of paper just a regular so we are going to check how this one cuts off I know I don't like to waste some of stuff of my paper but let's try this out anyway let's go see how this one goes it does make kind of noise when you cut it and if you have that tiny little piece of paper and let's go see because sometimes you really really have to protect your finger and stuff but see as you can see all the way down it's like a hill the the one that protects your finger it's like curvy all the way down though you don't have to put your finger down there it's not safe but at least here when you want to start in the middle you kind of like protected you know what I mean so let's check this one out I have this tiniest paper and I'm going to put this on this way edge of the trimmer and I push this plastic clear plastic and let's see oh wow okay that's awesome that's really sharp Ooh. okay that's that passes me and let's just say I want to start down here see I like it because it won't my fingernails or my fingers are protected even if I'm looking up on the camera and just to make sure if that face or that view is inside my camera so if I'm not paying attention if there is no protection down here I could cut my finger even though I'm looking on the screen of what my finger is looking so if I do this and I cut down I won't be afraid because my finger is protected with a sharp blade you know so it cuts really nice it's super clean see and the end is just right here see I like that so let's go see sorry about the noise Maybe because it's new, that's why it's making noise like that. And this one that has sparkles, it's always hard to cut when there's like sparkles. Because it, it kind of created a smear or it doesn't cut really nicely if you cut a paper trimmer. So, when you use this, let's go see how this one goes because sparkles are always the hard one to cut sometimes beside chipboards, okay? So, okay, that passes me. It's really nice. Really, really nice. Okay, and this one with the felt edge paper. This is just... This one is a regular paper on the back, but you know, as you can see, it's kind of thick. But there's a felt fur in it. So we'll see how this one goes. Oh, really nice. And this one is already even a thin, thin slice already. It does work wonder. I really like it. Let me go see again. Let's go see in a very, very thin output of paper to cut. Let's go see how this one goes because when you cut a paper that has textures in it like furry and stuff it's hard to cut it on other. Okay. Oh look at that. A very very thin and that is way thin already you guys. Super thin. Okay now now let's cut this one and use this and we'll see how it goes i'm pretty sure it's just the same it's just i'm going to go to a different version because of how i want the protection for my fingers when i'm glancing at the camera just to make sure the angle is right there inside the screen right there so sometimes I have to make sure that, oops, I don't have to go in and out just to make sure that my fingers is not really on the way or either the blade might cut my fingers, 
know what I mean? You know what I mean. It's not safe. Crafters, we did all kinds of sharp stuff, so we want safe, right? So this one, of course, I use this a lot. So as you can see, I have to really raise this all the time because when I push this, sometimes it's, it's, I have to make sure it's all the way up because if I don't then it's like the angle is like this I don't know but I really have to push this up let me go see if I can cut this in a something a little inch just a little see it makes me hold up in that area let's do it again it's not as cutting maybe because I use this too much so I have I had a hold up in there so I really really have to give it a give so I can cut it see as you can see and then if I look in the screen like that guys and I have to make sure that the angle is right there and if I'm not paying attention I won't realize my finger would just like you don't want that right so there is no stopper where like it holds your finger down because it just, you can see, it's not safe. But let me go see if I can cut a tiny little piece. If it holds. See, I really have to push this up just to make sure that the cutting that I'm doing is really, really thin. Let's go to the thinniest one. It does still work, wonder. Yeah. Okay. So there is no difference. But you really have to give a give when you cut a piece of paper that has textures in it. Let's go see this one with the sparkles. See, if I'm not paying attention, if I want to start at the bottom, I really have to hold it in because this is only like tiny little piece that holds my fingers. See, if you know what I mean, it's tiny. See. So when I cut it, and if I'm not paying attention and I'm looking here at the camera just to make sure that my fingers are in the right spot, I have to pay attention because I might cut my fingers. So I have to move in this groove and hold this my thumb and goes down there. And that still works, Wonder. But for me, I want safety. It's all nice. They are all nice and perfect. And one thing that I like about this because they have a drawer that you can hide stuff in there. And see, I got this cards in here. Sometimes I hide some stuff in here that, you know. Let's go see. And I'll show you guys how this one will cut. See, I like this one because there's also a drawer. They have differences, all kinds of differences. They have a rubber here, a mess, but there is no drawer for you to pull out. See, there's no drawer. Okay, so this one, if you turn it upside down, this one also have a rubber stopper. But this, the good thing is they have a drawer the drawer okay and let's go see this one this is like a thick cardboard or card stuff so it's it's still nice I like it and using my other one Let's go see if I cut on the way edge if how it works because sometimes you just want to try all kinds of crazy stuff just to make sure if it's you know proven and tested so this one is you have a spot that oops your finger will let you know that oops, it's time for you to stop there because you're gonna get cut down so of course you don't want to make it closer by accident you know you just still have to pay attention what you're doing <laughs> Because we don't want to lose our pretty fingers, you know. So, let's see how it goes. Boom! Here we go. It cuts out. I do like it. 
cuts it out. Although this one on the way edge is that's the only last part, but I push it all the way in where the where the blade was. That's why it, it ends up like that. See if you can see, I push it all the way in where the blade stop. So you really have to make sure that you're putting your paper where the blade stop. You're supposed to be in here, but see I push it all the way in to this end of that plastic. So you really have to stop where the blade ends. Okay, so that's the good thing. Especially if you want to see here, there's a bottom um, measure. And this one don't have a bottom measure. And if you want to see, like, if you want to cut in three and a quarter, and you want to see, you really count or you really measured it right. So you cut it. perfect. Cuts down really, really perfect. And that's what I like. And then they have this tiny little pieces that you can. Um, numbers it's really showing this one has none you really have to eyeball everything here there's only one two three and four while this one head out two one two three four five six and yep I like this paper trimmer and if you guys want this two kinds of paper trimmer go check them out on the description down below and please don't forget to subscribe on my channel that would be lovely and if you guys want something for me to review some stuff let me know and leave a comments on my comments bar right there and please guys don't forget to subscribe on my channel and don't forget to give it a thumbs up right there and subscribe down there and comments down there thank you so much guys for watching Shasha SJ you guys are awesome and thank you for the comments that you left on my comments and you guys are awesome thank you so much for coming by and spending time with me and if you have any questions give me a question down there and love you guys. Thank you so much for everything. Bye.